Clash! Victory or death! I will fight with honor. Do I keep Lights Justice if I have a Worgen Infiltrator? I think the answer is yes still. That's a good start. That's a good card. I was just thinking I was gonna make a guy there. That's a terrible play. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Keep it stealth, and I'll keep all the stuff hold. Weapons hold. Stealth hold. It's like he's using the weapon on a 1-1. Which is, uh, fine with me. So I get to actually kill this guy as a result. Hmm. Yeah, that might be better. That is better. I'll definitely target this as a priority. So I should put the uh, other guy to the left of him. Maiden guy is a pretty good move. Ooh, who am I? This is my responsibility. First kill. Play the maiden first, so it has a chance of getting spit on. Ah. Okay. They are bent to my command. Who am I? None of your business. This is my battle for justice. No, I shouldn't hero power first, because it gives him another chance to hit a one health guy off the toad. I wonder if Mukla's champion button was better. I must choose. Just secret paladin things. <laughs> I will fight with honor. I will command the light. Almost tempted to keep Mysterious Challenger in my opening hand. I was like thinking about it, but no. Hmm, here's my tier two hand here. Okay, this hand is now amazing. This... it's pretty hard to get Redemption the trigger on Haunted Creeper, though. It's like in what world... well, actually no, because he has a... Light's Justice. Very like, I mean, it's not that likely, but it's definitely reasonable for him to use the honey, the the, the mini bot to hit into the creeper. I have to make sure to try not to get my redemption to hit a one one though. This is gonna be pretty tough. Hmm, might be impossible to do. Ooh. Um. Okay. Let's try this. For justice. Eh, I don't know. So he knows it's not noble sacrifice. He knows it's not uh, eye for an eye. Wonder if he'll want to try to kill this in order to play around avenge. It's totally impossible. Come on, come on. Oh. 
Okay. You win this one. For justice. I mean, it could be a Venn, right? It's more commonly a Venn than Redemption. Well, the good news is if he's playing Consecration here, he's gonna hit the spider first. Well, no, that's not good news. We'll just hit both spiders. Oh my gosh. He bombed that one first. Sick. <laughs> That's gross. Always lucky. Hmm. Man, Direwolf Alpha would be so gross right now. Absolutely disgusting. Or Cult Master. Oh my gosh. But unfortunately, have none of the synergy right now. If I get Consecration, I probably lose. Well, I have play on hands. I still probably lose, though. Oh, yeah, misplay. This could have taken one less damage. Uh, what you want. The gates are open. <laughs> this ends up working well for me, huh? Uh, no point to lay on hands this. I wonder if I had something more ambitious. Like maybe I could have left the uh, the micro machine up. Could have been interesting. He does only have two cards left: one card he top decks, and this card and spare part. So I think I'm doing better. You're in trouble now. But my cards are kind of weak. Reporting for duty. Let's see, his target is most likely going to be the wolves, right? For the Lich King. Should be a pretty good cult master. Cult master currently appears to be drawing two cards and killing the board. Hmm. It's no longer this obvious. Okay, I can use the 3-4 and the 3-1 on this. Send the 2-2 two -two over there. This almost always kills Colt Master. We'll aim at Colt Master. So I should buff the Colt Master and put it next to the dog. This one only needs... Okay, so I do this. And I put the Cult Master here. Draw a card. Oh! Wait. Was there a. I don't If I had sent in the guy first, I could have played Hungry Dragon and MCT. But that requires so much foresight. I should have played Avenge. No, I didn't have enough mana to play all of it. Okay, I feel better. 
Oh man, Hungry Dragon MCT combo hype. Oh, that's also good though. One's better. I think this is more gross. Yeah. The battle. Yeah, it's a 5, 10, 13, 18, 19, 24. That's a lot of damage. Is that enough, Elsa? That's enough. Okay. Do I keep a tier 2 curve? Good enough. It's likely one of these will stay on the board, and the Cold Master will draw at least one card. It's not great, but it's pretty good. Oh, that just got better. Getting some really good early game curves. Wow, that's really good with uh, Cold Master. Huh. That's anti synergy. Wow! Okay, so I can play the dark. Well, this is probably better. Not sure how this is gonna pan out yet, but it looks like something will be good. Hmm. Can immediately draw a card and threaten to draw another card. But I'll go with this one. This threatens his uh, four mana, five health guy. Worst case is he plays a three two and then fire blast my one one. I don't have a good trade against that. Guess I would play Colt Master. That four plus two, or I can just trade with this stuff. Can I do something even better? Two plus three. That's not good enough. Can't just go four plus one either. I could do 4 plus 2 and then make a guy. That seems bad. Darewolf Alpha Guy? No, that seems bad also. I think Darewolf Alpha plus Guy is best. Next turn I can Cult Master plus. Yeah, yeah, okay. Seems weak, but that's a really strong card. Could have just gotten face with everything. But then the water elemental kills the wolf. And the wolf is like a pretty good card here. So I can use the Cult Master to draw two cards. Wolf and uh, Bluegill go in. Seems good. It's decent. It's not great, but it's alright. So I'm gonna someday dig for Muster, and then Muster, Guy, Gormok. Hmm. It's definitely something that can happen. <laughs> I should trade into that, right? <laughs> Guy is too weak right now, I think I go 3-3. Three, three. It's either Shredder plus Guy, or... 3 plus 3. Maybe I play Gormok without the buff. I can go uh, Guy plus Starwolf plus Illuminator. Or Jungle Panther. Jungle Panther, Direwolf, Guy, I think, on this turn. No, I should kill this. It stops the wolf from. Uh, Hard to say, really. Okay. 
Okay, so I currently have enough damage for the champion. That's a value exchange there. He wants to get rid of a 1-1 before it dies. At least that's how I read it. Okay, with the light's justice, I'm able to... I still can't play Gorma, and still MCT doesn't work. I kind of want that to stay alive, right? So maybe I should just take this turn to lay on hands. Uh, has a chance of MCTing then. And I purposely fall behind here. I leave a 2 2 on the board where I could normally kill it. So I should consider my options. My choices are either Illuminator, Guy, Lights, Justice, Float 2, Mana, even Ogre. Now I'm gonna lay. got a chance at a huge comeback here. The lay might get him to play four minions, and then I MCT, and then I'll have three minions, I make a guy, and then I play Gormok the Impaler, and that's a huge swing. Huge swing. This swing could be huge. Oh, it's huge! I actually can't play Gormak. But oh, well, this is really good. Now to think about playing around Flame Strike. Micro Machine, Guy, Lights, Justice, I think is the bare bones. Seven, twelve, fourteen. Seven, ten, twelve. I actually just died a fireball. I should not have swung at that with Light's Justice. Oops. Didn't look like that much damage. Always lucky, never punish though. I figured the Micro Machine is going to the 3-3, three, three, so I didn't bother hitting that. I thought about hitting Face. But John Reflection is better. I wonder if he had gone all Face, whether or not that would have been better. Probably not, because he needs to... Do all this stuff. Got the North Sea Kraken for that guy. Or I could muster for Battle of Gormok. Let's play a North Sea though. And although I did just get Warhorse Trainer, which encourages me to play Muster Guy in a Gormok. Unless I think he picked. Well. I don't know if you picked a board clear or if you picked... If it's a board clear, this isn't really that much of a board anyways, though. It's really good for Warhorse Trainer. For justice. I think I play a guy over a... a, a card. Since this is AoEable right now, so now I might as well not throw a card in there. It's really hard to tell whether or not he takes like a big AoE or like one single answer. And there's no real way to ever know. He took a big answer, so it turns out that this play is way better since Cormoth got Flame Lance rather than North Sea Kraken. I mean, there's no way to really know until the play happens whether or not it's good. And objectively, you have no idea. Uh, it just turned out that this time around it was correct. I think if I didn't have the Warhorse Trainer, I'd have taken a different path. I'm surprised he didn't flame strike the board, being told that he had it in his hand for a while. 
That board of Gormok and four guys. Very surprised he didn't flame strike it. Interesting question. Do I value my six health over one one one? So I'm at eighteen. I'd go down to twelve. If I use the weapon, he has. I have too many guys from the fire blast. Like I'm at eighteen. The it's five cards. He hasn't burned me down earlier. I want my 1-1. One, one. Like, I have no cards. I have to use every single resource I can. And if that means spending 6 health for a 1-1, one, one, I think I should do that. Magic one grain of rice could tip the scales of war. Source, Mulan. Okay, so I use the raptor in my weapon against the 4-4. Four, four. How do I kill the 2-5 without using the 9-2? I don't think there's a way to do that. So it looks like I have to send the 9-2 against the 4-4. Although I could just uh, simply ignore the 4-4. 4-4 is probably going to my 9-2. That would be interesting. Never lucky, no mysterious challenger. Hmm, well, it's a forced fire blast. But he was probably planning to fire blast. Look, I have a uh, four, five, six, eight, nine. Maybe that one extra damage. One one scale of one one grain of rice. Tips the scales of war. Maybe it still has five cards, so you never know, right? I must protect the wild. I will fight with honor. Mysterious challenger is sad. These cards aren't bad. Eh, they're bad. Eh, they're not that bad. Avenge guy. Or MCT. Avenge guy is technically a 4-3. MCT... This hand is pretty terrible. I might actually lose control of the board forever. Redemption is really bad. Huh. If I played the MCT against this guy, I'd have five damage. Direwolf Alpha, but I didn't have a Direwolf Alpha, so I had no idea. I think I just make a guy and pass. Redemption is certainly terrible. Can't play the Direwolf into this. It's a slow play on his side, but might be fast enough. So next turn he's going to play a 4-6 with Taunt. I'll be able to freeze it, and then I would be able to kill it with this. So therefore, I think I should be playing these two. And then I play the Frost Elemental, freezing it, and then I play the Direwolf Alpha on the Frost Elemental. 
I don't think things will ever... I'm not going to be able to use this this game. It's just not going to work. If I had another three, I'd have happily played it over the MCT. I must safeguard the man. Well, this at least went according to plan. <sighs> I wonder if attacking first like that was correct on his side. Like, what if I avenge the Frost Elemental? Yeah, no mind control attack, but if I didn't have a mind control attack earlier, things could have snowballed out of control. Whoa, did he turn one Raven Idol for an Iron Bark Protector? What the? What? But, 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 but Keeper of all the men. Looking for exactly Argent Protector here. Nope. Sadness. Eh, maybe his cards are terrible. Nine, thirteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay. Oh wait, I still no. Because even though it's an early game card, it's a mysterious challenger and it's not even that good. Oh, that's a saucy hand. Might want to try to coin that mysterious challenger here. This hand might be good enough for just um, 2, 3, 4, 5. Huh. Although now I want to coin out muster for battle. So he's obligated to weapon up next turn, but the weapon is not very good against my muster guys. The pleasure is mine. Well met. Could also just play a two drop. So many options. Hmm. Interesting attack there. I guess, I don't know. Hmm. 
I didn't realize I was VMing Jar Jar Binks there, oops. <laughs> it's time for a little blood. Okay, so two different lines here. Line number one, MCT. Line two, Direwolf. Uh, line two seems better. For justice. I oh, have to use this one. It's kind of important. Eh, it's not really that important. A shame that he used the weapon to face on turn two. Because then if he didn't, his weapon would be available to kill the direwolf alpha. So, a small ploy, but it's gonna end up being very important. Wow. Yeah, wow! Okay. Hungry Dragon? Mm. Nah, I wanna keep Hungry Dragon in mind control attack, right? Or is that too specific combo? Hit hit, play Hungry Dragon. I'll make the future plays pretty good. I'm not gonna get the 7 mana. Hungry Dragon, hit hit. Ah. <sighs> I'm losing so much tempo. It's a big play there. Oh well. At least that result's pretty good. I think. Mostly. So hopefully he plays two minions and passes. Well, hits face. Ugh. Sabotaged. Okay, by the time he gets four minions I'll be dead. Okay, Dr. Six is here to clean up. Not so much. I have a lot of support cards here. And this card requires me to be not on the verge of death. So many options. But that card at least promises to be good. That card's pretty good. Could actually uh, purify that and kill it. But this is better. If the 4 or 5 decides to go into the 3 2, I can purify. Which would be really good. And if he decides to leave it up, I can just send the 3 2 in and then purify, which is really good. I go Cult Master Purify. This mysterious challenger has been surprisingly good for me. Checks for get down. Course. Hmm. These are two cards I can purify. I can hit that and then purify and then hit that. Cult Master Purify? Clear the board other than this thing. Do I have some non suicidal way? You can leave this up and then he only has a. Leave up the shredder, perhaps. Yeah, leave up the shredder. No, that's not really much better. Ugh. It's tough, man. I should try to go for the freezing one. Oh, I'm not done. That's good. I'm not dead yet. Currently don't really... Eh, I can still kill that, kind of. Do I have any taunts in this? Illuminator, that's my way out, huh? I can return this and then, but that's no good. Oh my gosh. Pretty sure that wasn't going to work, right? I'd like to convince myself of that. Alright, so he needs to get a one health, one attack minion here. Oh, we're still in it. 
Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, my face. <laughs> 